Dermot Desmond is a, is a gentleman in the true sense. I think, and he's a man of integrity and kindness. Um, and that rubs off on people when you meet him. I, I kind of describe myself as a, as a person that looks after many businesses and I lose money on a diversified basis. I do things really I enjoy. I'm passionate about Celtic Football Club. Here's Johansson, Griffiths, Commons, Brown is brilliant from Celtic. Because of the whole Irish tradition there, I've been involved over 20 years there. Um, I'm passionate about some of the business that we started here, biometrics business. I'm an eclectic, um, idiotic individual that's involved in lots of different things that he knows very little about. A friend of mine uh, over 20 years ago asked me would I consider be chairman of respect for a year. We cater for around 1,500 people uh, with an intellectual disability. Our mission is uh, one of inclusion, social justice, making sure that people are valued for who they are and that they're, we look more on their abilities rather than their disabilities. This is me real important, our key. And that's my bedroom key. And why I like this key? Because I can lock my door to keep my room privacy. You know, the privacy is really the difference of all. He's all the time trying to raise the bars for people with intellectual disability. And, uh, you know, if looking around this beautiful homes today, you can see the difference that his involvement has, has made. I think it's about responsibility. We've got a responsibility to give everybody a way of life that we think that should exist for our loved ones. When Dermot Desmond approached me about five years ago to take on this role, um, it was his own passion actually that convinced me to take it up. Doctorate is an international research network. It uh, combines the, all of the universities on the island of Ireland, so nine universities, it's uh, two universities in the US, including University of Massachusetts Medical School. And our primary focus is on the person with intellectual disability or autism spectrum disorder, and how best to use uh, technologies, particularly assistive technologies, uh, to better the lives of people with uh, intellectual disability or autism. I would like to congratulate Dermot on this great achievement and richly deserved. I think it's a great recognition for Dermot uh, himself uh, his philanthropy, his uh, unwavering support. But it's also an honour for all the people who work in respect and in doctorate. Respect probably wouldn't have survived without um, the commitment of uh, Mr Desmond. We would like to thank him for his commitment, for his dedication, for his energy and um, for all that he has done for us. I'm very humbled. Um, and I genuinely mean that. Uh, I feel myself that I, like I'm, I genuinely feel this is I'm an imposter here. It is really the, the volunteers and the carers to respect and to doctors are the real heroes here. And it's on behalf of them that I really am accepting this honour.